This show was brought to you by patrons such as Tay Lin, Dharma Wheelies, It's My Milk in a Box, Phone Losers of America, Fancy Pants, MST3 Clay, Gordo, Crispy A08, and Mr. Turbois. Thank you to everybody for supporting the show. You can find out more about the show at immoralhole.com. You can find our archives at travelswithmiriam.com. You can help contribute to the show via Ko-fi, Patreon, or cryptocurrencies. Find out more at immoralhole.com. Uh, Hello? Hi. Hey, I got this new number. I just wanted to let you know I got it. You got a new number? Yeah. What new number you got? Well, this is my number now, because my old number wasn't working, so I don't know if you were trying to get a hold of me or not, but this is my new number. Oh, uh, who is this? This is Frankie. Frankie? Yeah. I think you, you know, I'm down wrong. at the bar. You and I, we drink all the time. Sometimes we get a little too wasted, and we, you know, we go to the hotel sometimes, and we explore each other's bodies. Suck each other off. Hello? Hi, how are you? In the bed asleep? You're in the bed asleep? Yes, I am. Oh, I'm I'm sorry. Like, did I call too late? Yeah, 1030. Oh, I'm sorry. Get the fuck out of that bed now. It's time to talk. Hi. Hello? What? I'm sorry that I got I got my church voice. That was the devil coming inside of me and I didn't mean to speak to you in that way. Can can we negotiate about the listing? About the what? The list. You have something for sale, right? What was I supposed to sell? Yeah, what are you selling? Like You said you had a bed frame. Oh, yes, I do. A, a, a queen, yeah. I want to buy it. How much is it? $300, what I paid for it. Okay, but how much are you going to make me pay for it? $300, what I paid for it. Okay, um... That that's fine, uh, but I just have to ask because I'm uh, I'm not really with the whole government regulations thing. How much of the money that I pay to you are you gonna pay to the tax man? What are you talking about? Like when I give you money, how much is that? How much of that is sales tax? No tax at all. Just three hundred dollars. Okay, so you don't have your state sales tax license. No. Oof, that sounds that sounds kind of iffy to me. How long have you been selling off off the grid like this? What are you talking about? Who are you? Well, the 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 tax man's always looking for his money, and I don't want to get on the bad side of the tax man. So, I mean, are you an independent contractor? Are you a five hundred one c three? I'm just an old woman that's got a bed for sale. That's all it is. You're. You're you're an old pensioner, is what you're saying. You you do know taxes are due on January seventeenth if you file quarterly. Look, if you want the bed, tell me you do. If you don't, I'm I'm through. How many times has the is the frame been used? How many what? How has the frame been used before, or is it still brand no, new? No, it's it's in the box. It's in the box? Okay. Now, I just wanted to make sure. So, like, you have your own S-Corp, right? And you pay yourself dividends every quarter? Look, call back when you know what you're talking about. Okay. (laughs) Hello? 
Hey, what, what's, what's with you in the shaft? What's that now? The shaft. What is that? Yeah, you're, you got a shaft for sale? It's vertical? No, I got a truck for sale. Oh, I thought you had a shaft. What is a shaft? Why, well, that's what this thing said right here. Does the truck have a shaft? Like a drive train shaft? Well, it's a, where are you reading this from? A, a swap shop? Yeah, like I'm on here right now. It says uh, shaft for sale. I don't know if it had. It doesn't have a like a uh, like a machine. And in the listing, it says, "Who's the black private dick that's a sex machine to all the chicks?" And then it says shaft. I don't know about that. And then it says that you're damn. Is it, and then it says you're damn right. And then it's got this phone number. Oh, I don't know who that is. That ain't me, sir. I ain't got okay, no but you got a truck. truck? I got a truck. Yeah. But and it, but it, does it have a drive shaft? Is it the thing that twirls around inside of the transmission that makes it's, the wheels go? It's a running. It's a running truck. Uh, okay. And what color is it? It's 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 uh, black. Oh, maybe that's where they got it. Because right here it says, who's the black private dick that's a sex machine to all the chicks? And then it says shaft. So maybe that's what's going on. I don't need you. I think you got the wrong number, sir. I, I honestly do. I don't know what you're talking about. Well, no, I, I, double, I double checked it because I'm very paranoid that I dial wrong numbers because I'm dyslexic like that. Yeah, where are you located at? I'm over here behind the computer. Listen, I spent a shitload of time doing Linux stuff this week. Trying to get stuff yeah. configured and routed. Yeah. Well, I tell you what, I, yeah. I, don't, I don't, I don't know about that, but I, I believe you. I don't, I don't believe. I don't know what you're talking about, and uh, I just, uh, I'm, I'm lost. But, okay. Yeah. Well, one last question: How many miles are on the truck? I have no idea. What'd you say? Is it below a hundred thousand, above a hundred thousand, below two thousand, hundred thousand? Hey, it's a, it's a seventy-one mile. It could have four hundred thousand on. Okay. Well, I mean, usually in a good truck, that's just breaking them in, though. When you start approaching, you know, two hundred fifty thousand, it's starting to get. You're just now breaking them in and getting them in their prime. Okay. All right. Well, I, I, I appreciate so, you calling. Hey, 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 Well, hang on a second. How much are you asking for it? Uh. Well, right now, I decided about to keep the thing because I'm going to do some work to it. I understand. It's Let me have you do this, high. though. Un 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 unbutton your jeans and look down your pants and see if you have a pecker. Hello? Hmm. This, hey, guys, this lady answered the phone. I think she's a phone sex operator. Here, let me put it on speakerphone. Hello? Hi, how much do you charge a minute? How do you how much do you charge a minute? You've got the wrong number. Hang on, I'll get my no, I'll pay, I'll pay. Let me get my card out. Yeah, but it's just it's a half ass cold. Hello? Don't be cold here no damn more, fella. Hey, I got a half ass cold, motherfucker. Don't yell at me. Hello? Hello? No, guys, he answered. Wait, hello? We found yes, this sir. number on on, a, on the Walmart bathroom in the handicap stall. We didn't think it was a real number. We didn't think anybody would answer. Hello? hello? Okay. Are we going to have It looked like it... We, yeah. Well, what it says for a good a good Buick to call, but it looks like in different ink. It said, it might have said for a good fuck. Oh, really? Yeah. Uh, we didn't think anybody would answer, so we tried. Uh, guys, he an guys, he answered. He answered. Are we gonna uh, are we uh, Kentucky? Yeah. yeah. All right, that's not too far. I'm all away. Hello. 
Hello? Hi. Hello. This is my new number. I finally got in hold of you, and I finally have a new number for you to call me back on. Who is this? This is Frank. How are you doing? This is who? Frank. Yeah, yeah, we've been trying to get a hold of each other, I think, and I finally got your number. I finally got a new number, so I, you can finally call me back and leave a message whenever you have a chance, you know, to look over the uh, contract. Okay. Uh, refresh me. I don't, I'm not sure we got you, you got the right person. I was calling you with regard to the contract uh, with the estate. I think we've been playing phone tag, but my machine wasn't working, so I got a new number. Um, okay, uh, is this on the uh, the property in Habersham? Yes. Okay, I don't think I've spoken with you, have a friend? No, I, I just, I, I'm taking over because uh, my colleague's uh, sick with the flu, but uh, they should be back any day now. It's just um, taking over for the time being, making sure everything is going along correctly and Make sure we get the job done. Okay. And you are. And who are you with, Frank? What, who, what company are you with? Uh, what office are you with? Oh, I'm with the machine. The machine? Yeah. I don't know if we're on the same sheet of paper. <laughs> uh, oh, yeah, yeah. Uh, I'm with the machine, the estate machine. Uh, no, you got the wrong person. Oh, no, no, you're the right person. We were working on this for like six months now. Come on. Yeah, you're talking about the, the property, right? Yeah, the the property estates, the machine yeah. there. Oh, okay. And I deal with the, the rental machines. Okay. Yeah. Oh. Because right, uh, you were renting equipment to, to do things over, I thought. That's what we have here. There's a contract here for two hundred seventeen thousand uh dollars -uh. no, for renting equipment from the machine. Mm. No, you got the wrong person. I got your number here. It's written down. It says call. Uh, maybe maybe this is a different property that we're discussing. Well, I'm purchasing a piece of property. I am buying, right. I'm, buying some, I'm buying some land. Right, and the machines on the land. Uh, not to my knowledge. There's a check mark next to your name on the paperwork here. Everything is official here. No, I'm not sure who you talk. Who, what machine you speaking of? It's the uh, the horse machine. Uh. -uh. No. Uh, what animal know. machines do you have? Well, are you I looking don't. for a machine for the animals? Is that no? Because uh -uh. this was reviewed and approved. No, it wasn't me, but no. It's rubber stamped, and we have here the the check that cleared for two hundred seventeen thousand. Mm, mm, not me. So you you paid us, so that's the good news. You're all set there. <laughs> uh, we do have to let you know that it is a super fun site. And the EPA has to come out and check out uh, everything every couple of years. Uh, might want to get the groundwater tested. That's probably a good idea, considering what happened there. Uh, you, you got wrong. You know about the incident, about right? The incident. Hi, I'm calling Hello? from immersive shitting. Let me put my brother on because I'm deaf. Hi. What? Uh, what? With, hi, um, I'm looking for Bob. Don't know what you're talking about, bud. Next time you call, I have a prank call since I walk in the door and you see me walk in the door of my house. Hey, hey, fuck yourself, hey, 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 listen, hey, motherfucker. motherfucker. Yeah, yeah. Hello? Hello? Hi. Hi. That's a very tasteful voicemail. Hello? Hi, did you get my voicemail? Did you get my voicemail? <clears throat> no. What I time didn't... do you want me to come over and cl what time do you want me to come over and clip your toenails? <laughs> uh, you better you better try somebody else. Goodbye. No, listen, I got the me I got the message. What time do you want me to clip your toenails? Uh, 
hello. Hi, I'm coming over to cut your toenails. Is now a good time? Huh? I'm calling about your toenail troubles. <laughs> My toenail troubles. Oh. Is now a good time? <laughs> now a good time. Oh, well. Hell, yeah, whatever. <laughs> I'm taking that as a yes. Now, what's your address, dear, so I can put it into my scam sheet? I mean, my, my GPS. <laughs> Who is this? Well, this is a Toe Shop. Yeah, Toe, toe Shop. <laughs> oh, shit. The Toe Shop. Oh, hell. Yeah, yeah I heard it all now. <laughs> oh, shit. Can I come over now, or... It's now a bad time. Huh? It's now a good time or a bad time to inspect them toes. <laughs> uh, whatever. Yeah. <laughs> oh, shit. Yeah, sure. All right, then. I'll see you in a few. Yeah, all right. <laughs> Bye, Mom. Bye. 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 <laughs> mean. Huh? Mean. Do what mean. now? Hi. Huh? Hi, this is Jack. Do what? How are you? I'm Jack. Well, well. Hello, hello, hello ma'am. That's, that's my invalid of a son. Uh, and he's doing a uh, a school fundraiser, and he has to collect as many toenail clippings as he can. Uh, so can he come over and clip your toenails? Yeah. Oh, and yeah. Do you remember in school? Do you remember in school you made pasta art? You know where you glue the pieces of pasta to construction paper? Well, I'm doing toenail. Oh yeah. Okay. You, you you remember when you used to have to bring in like pop bottle tops, like the little the little tabs, like yeah. it's like that, but with toenails. Yeah. <laughs> so so he he needs to come collect as much toenails from oh, you as you'll allow. <laughs> oh, it's, for, it's it's for little Billy over in the special class. He need, yeah. he needs a spare wheelchair tire. He's he's got a flat. Oh, okay. I need different color. Yeah, hey, I need don't... different colors though. Do you yeah, have like a don't... fungal infection? Because <laughs> if you had a if you had a fungal infection, then I would have like greens and browns, which would be a nice color blend. Oh, all right. there you go. <laughs> yeah. And if your if your if your nails are really infected, then I could have like some black nails too. <laughs> Damn. Damn, well. If, if, if I tell you. Yeah, I mean, if they're not infected enough for them to be, like, a really dark color, could yeah. you just, like, slam your foot in the door a couple times or shut a window <laughs> on your foot? That'll do it. Oh, I don't think so. <laughs> hey, I don't think so. No, I'm not, no I ain't slamming no damn Ma door. Ma'am, could, 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 he, could he come in Wally Coyote style and drop an acne anvil on your foot? Hell no. Come on, he 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 can be the road runner and he could drop an acne anvil right on your big toe and turn it all purple and throbby and blah 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 blah. Not, not, blah. No, not only no, but hell no. <laughs> uh, wait, wait, can you escalate that to a can you escalate that to a fuck no? Yeah, yeah, fuck no. <laughs> Yeah, there you go. No, 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 no. All right. Now, 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 repeat after me. One. <laughs> Do what now? No, no. Just, just, just repeat after me. Uh, the first thing that comes to your mind. One. 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 What? No, no. Well, I'm gonna say we're gonna do word association. I'm gonna say I'm gonna say a word, and then you tell me the first thing that comes to your mind. So, one. Hell no. <laughs> okay, blue. What? Blue. It's a color. Sky. <laughs> BBC. Huh? 
BBC. 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 Yes. I have no damn idea. What comes to my mind? Okay. Um. T Titanic. What? Titanic, like the boat. Titanic. <laughs> they all did. <laughs> oh, okay. Uh, what no, about? No, no. Uh, well, they didn't all die. I mean, that I is mean, uh, uh, historically inaccurate. Jack, Jack would have survived if that little hussy yeah, fucking didn't push, push him off the fucking piece of wood. There was room. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Yeah. There you go. Uh, <laughs> sure. Where's your um, husband at? Yeah, I was just about to ask that too. Where's Husby? What? Where's your, Where's your husband? husband? Is he in the freezer? Like, where is he? Who's your husband? Yours. Yours. Yeah. I don't have no damn husband. Do you want one? No. <laughs> yeah, we need to. Uh, I need I'm someone to take care of me. I need to be a kept man. Yeah. yeah no. Man, we have a social security. We have a social security check scam going on. We can make you very, very well kept. Yeah. Sure. Sure. Right. Yeah. I hear everything. We now. print. We we print checks. Yeah. Yeah. We'll we'll keep you in we'll keep you in best value pasta and best value toilet paper. All yeah. that you want. Don't forget about the bonbons too. We'll fucking get you <laughs> bonbons and some leopard print little little oh, tiny my tights. God. Yeah. Oh wow! I know. Get you all uh, the napkin holders you'd ever want. Yeah, and listen, we'll come over there, and I'll knock, I'll knock the dust off your doilies, if you know what I'm saying. <laughs> Whatever. <laughs> Whatever. Yeah. <laughs> all right. All right. Now, now, make some weird sounds. Let's go. I don't think so. What is wow, it? Is that where you what draw the line? Yeah. That's really weird. Man, it's weird. Did you please what? talk in one incredible what? Hello? Huh? What? <clears throat> Tell now. I was gonna ask. Yeah. yeah, I was gonna ask if uh maybe you could talk in one long incredibly unbroken sentence and maybe move from topic to topic and make it quite hypnotic. Can you do that? Uh, yeah. No. No, thank you. Hypnotic's wow, a good, good booze. Yeah, hypnotic's a good booze drink, too. I mean, it tastes like Kool-Aid. Hmm. No. Uh, uh, I don't think so. Which, have you been drinking tonight, ma'am? Yeah. What? I said, I have know, you been drinking drink. tonight? Yeah, Can you tell us what it was like to live back in 1920s? Yeah, what was it like before automobiles and colored televisions? Tell us. You wanna... Tell us about the time you saw the the first non-white person. Oh, my God. I'm, God damn, I'm oh, not... Was it, it was that, that, tra it was that traumatic, huh? Yeah. I'm not no antique, okay? <laughs> Whatever. What was it like? Like, what were like? When you signed the Constitution. <laughs> yeah, that. Oh, yeah. Yeah, whatever. Oh, whatever. Yeah, whatever. What? No, hey, listen, whatever to you, whatever. That's right, whatever. Did you, um, did you have an ice box? Did smelly what? men come over to your house? Yeah, like uh, an ice box. Did smelly men come over to your house and slide big blocks of ice into what was supposedly a refrigerator? Mm. I don't think so. Oh, you just don't remember, huh? Uh, uh, you know that happens when you get old. Your memory starts to go. Yeah. yeah. I hope she knows that I'm, I'm printing. I'm printing a transcript of this call into Braille. Yeah. <laughs> excuse me. Bless you. Yeah. Uh, excuse me. I have the itis. Yeah, huh? Yeah, he's got diabetes. It makes him sneeze. Oh, yeah. Well, <laughs> Too much sugar makes me sneeze. Oh, uh, yeah, right. Mm -hmm. Too much sugar. Do you think Wilford Brimley was sexy? Did what? Wilford Brimley. Did you think Wilford Brimley was sexy? I don't know. I can't hardly hear you, my yeah, phone. Yeah, man. I'm 
Uh, he, had, he had manners, though. He'd leave the light on for you. Yeah. Oh, that was Tom Bodette. Never mind. Yeah, Wilfred Brimley uh, was the diabetes guy. Yeah, he would leave the cookies out for you. Oh, yeah, sure. That's just what, what you need for diabetes. Yeah, sure. he, he, he put a cookie on a string. He'd, like, hide in the bedroom. And then he'd put, like, a cookie on a string in the kitchen. And then you try to grab the cookie and he pulled the string just a little bit until yeah. you got all the way in the bedroom and he closed the door and had his way with you. Oh, and yeah. Right. That's, that's, what, you. that's how it happened to E.T. too, but it was Skittles. Oh, hell. Right, E.T. Uh-huh. I'll be damned. You know why they called E.T. E.T., don't you? Why that? Because he had an extra testicle. Oh, no. Damn. Ah, shit. Yeah. Well, I'll be damned. Yeah. That's, that's, that's really interesting. Hey, that's really interesting to know. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Well, so hey, what are you going to yeah. do about it, Joe? I'm, huh? How do you plan to deal with it? How deal do you plan what? to deal with it, though? Deal with what? The extra testicle. Yeah. <laughs> How do, you, uh, how do you deal with the extra testicle when you only have two hands and one mouth? <laughs> uh, 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 uh. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. I, I give up, you, you need tell Jesus. me. That's, that's, yeah, that's it. You need Jesus. I've come to that conclusion. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Uh-huh. I'll be there. Uh-huh. Uh, so what now? Uh, I'll be damned. All right. <laughs> mm -hmm. All right. Yeah. 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 All right. What is? What? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> hey, mama. Yeah. <laughs> <My> mother. <laughs> what? Shut the hell up, you? <laughs> <laughs> hey. Hi, hi, mom. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, where, where were Beavis and Butthead's parents, really? Right here. Oh, uh, yeah, okay. Somebody was, somebody was paying the rent. Who was uh, paying the you're, rent? Uh, you are Beavis and Butthead's parents. Well, I'll be damned. <laughs> yeah, I'll be damned, all right. Uh-huh. I'll be damned. I'll be damned. <laughs> did did oh, you like Metallica or, a, or ACDC? What? Yeah, I'll be damned. <laughs> knock, knock. What are you both on? <laughs> knock, knock. Each other. What? God damn it. Knock, knock. Knock, knock. Who's there? Safonda. Yeah, I'll be damned. <laughs> yeah, okay. <clears throat> well, you're really bad at this. <clears throat> You should yeah. probably knock again. I don't think she gets it. Knock, knock. Wow, you, knock, this knock, is knock, why knock. this is why you don't have any friends. This is why you don't have any friends. You never answer the door. Oh uh, yeah, that's all right. You, what if uh, what if Ed McMahon came to the door with a ten million dollar check and then you didn't answer the door? Uh, I don't I think. think about I don't have to. I don't think I have to worry about that. <laughs> I think you do. I think you got a lot of things to worry about. You're just not worrying enough about them. Yeah. Uh, I want I want you to worry. I want you to worry about everything. I want you to be paranoid. Yeah, oh shit, not me. You know what I'm talking about? I mean, tomorrow, be paranoid. A, tomorrow a big rock could hit the earth. You could go flying. Yeah. You whatever. I'm not worried about what happens. Well, I don't live in no. fear. Don't think about. It. I don't live in fear and think about shit like that. Hmm. Nope. I do. Well, like, what if a wild good. bird swooped down? Yeah. What if a wild bird just swooped down and pecked your eyes out? What would you do? I don't think you have to worry about that either. What if a wild animal just like broke through your window and struggle cuddled you? What would you do? I don't think you're not worried about that either. Hmm. I don't think you're normal then. Oh yeah, I'm normal. I 
think you're Abby normal. Yeah. Okay, whatever. Can you say here's to the finest crew in Starfleet engage? Can you say that? I don't I don't have a I don't feel like saying that. Why well, it's it's there's nothing wrong with it. I mean Captain Picard was very proud of his crew. Mm-hmm. You know. It it was a it was like a meritocracy, but not, you know what I mean? Like somebody had to scrub the toilets on the Starship Enterprise. Oh, yeah. I'm in it. Hmm. So are you like good looking or? Do you clean up really well? Do you go to the clubs at, on Saturday night? Do what? I said, do you do you clean up well? Do you go to the clubs hunting for men? No, I don't go. Nice little. Don't go no, no, I don't go no damn clubs. What about the bowling alley? No. Hmm. I don't go anywhere. Ever, I stay right here. Oh. Huh? Well, you got no men. What what happened? Why don't you have a man? The what? Why don't you have a man? Why don't you go on one of these apps like Tinder or something? Get you some, get you somebody. Ain't no dad. I don't want no man. Why not? I said no. What, maybe you want a woman? I've got a woman. You do? Mm-hmm. Put her on the phone. Oh, she's not here. She does. She doesn't live here right now. No. No. You guys. You guys are. Yeah. No. You spending some time apart, so she reevaluate the whole situation. Nope. Nope. We don't have no problems at all. Yeah, I don't believe it. And you know what I believe is really what matters. I know what I know. That's the main thing. Do you have any furniture for sale? No. Do you have anything you don't want that maybe you want to sell? Any what? Old cabinet. I don't know. Like, you got anything around the house that you want to liquidate? Let's make a no. deal. Yeah, right. I'm trying to find a way in which we can transact between us, you know, have mm-hmm. some kind of, you know, successful interaction here, but you're just stonewalling me at every attempt. Yeah. Try to knock, knock joke. Uh, Try to get you a man. Oh, damn, man. <clears throat> Why? What the hell Give me one good reason. Huh? Well, give me one reason why you don't want a man. Oh, well, I'm not in the man. Where do you live? You don't have to tell me the Bump city, but tell me like... Buttfuck? What? Bumfuck Egypt. But Bumfuck Egypt. Yep. You, are you one of them Biden liberals? Is that what you are? Yep. Nope. What, what, what are you all? Oh, I'm still hoping Ralph Nader can win. Yeah. yeah. Okay. Good. Remember him? Mm-hmm. <clears throat> Do you remember the guy that looked like the Purdue Chicken Man? Yeah, what was his name? I have no idea. What oh, I hear somebody. I hear somebody. I hear somebody. That's that was my clock. No, that's my clock. It's my clock. Tell me what time it is. <laughs> that's what it is. So what what are your plans? What are you going to do? Do what? Do you have any plans for the future, like, that involve not being on the phone? Like, do you have any plans? 
Hmm. <laughs> well, I don't have no plans. It's becoming very evident that there are no plans. No. Nope. So, what you doing? I'm I'm back. I just got back from the bathroom, ma'am, and discovered I had a boil on my ass. Wow, that's incredibly interesting. Isn't it interesting, ma'am? Come on. No. Ma'am? 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 What? Hi. No, it's not I'm in the bathroom. I'm shit. I'm I, I'm shit. I'm shit. I'm trimming my pubic hairs right now. With the with the toenail clippers that I mentioned in the beginning. Oh, well, good for you. I'm trimming the lawn, as they say. Uh huh. Uh huh. And so, should I go like? Do should I do the mullet? The mullet of the pubic hairs? Should I do the party in the back and all business in the front? Or what do I do? How do I do? That's up to you. Yeah, but what are the ladies like? Should I go with a nice old? Well, you she used to be one. Who did? You. You're full of shit. No, don't say shit to me, fuck. Okay. Well, full of shit. No, don't say shit to me, fuck. Well, I'm saying so, what I want. No, uh, no, nah, I'll take your license to to speak as a woman. I'll take it away from you. I'll make you reapply for woman services machines and, and then I all don't that. Think, so I should, don't think it's, hey, I don't li- think. Li- li- listen, li- listen. Put a butter knife in your hand and a piece of bread. You'll figure out what to do. It's okay. Yeah, honey. whatever. Yeah. Yeah. Why don't you Why don't you go ahead? You get a bottle of mayo. You get some mustard. You get whatever meats you have in the fridge. You put a You put a bread in your hand and a fucking butter knife in your hand. And you'll figure it out. Your instincts will kick in. Yeah. Whatever. Yeah. What do What do you mean? Whatever. What do you? Okay. In this scenario, you're in the kitchen. You have one house slipper on. Your robe is slightly open. You have a, a butter knife. We're not sure if it's metal or plastic yet. And then you have a piece of wholesome king size bread in the other hand. What do you do? I don't. I, I don't have all that shit in my hand. You what? I don't have all that what do you shit mean? in my hand. I don't need. What do you mean? Why? Why? It's dope. It's dope. Listen, 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 bitch. So what you're gonna do is you're gonna go and you're gonna get the mail. You're gonna get the knife. I don't knife. think so. I and, don't think so. And then. God damn it, make a know. fucking effort already. No. Nope. Yeah. What are you contributing? You know, honestly, like, what, we're doing all the work here. Like, what are you giving? Like, what are you accomplishing? I'm listening to the damn news. Oh, shit. No, news. That's what I said. Ma'am, ma'am you, can't, you can't just say that willy-nilly. I mean, they, did, they went through a holocaust, ma'am. There was almost a genocide. Uh, whatever. All right, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to just cut to the chase. This whole time you've been dancing around what you really want from us. And, yes, we will meet you at Walmart for a threesome. I don't think so. I think so. I'll you bring my toenail cutting knife. You do. You take care of each other. You're doing all right. No, we're tired of each other. Yeah, which gender were you assigned at birth, madam? I'm not a madam. Since when? All my life. I'm a real boy. I'm a real boy. Not a boy either. I'm a hell of a man. Hi. No. Uh, that's my sister. So. That's my that's um, my 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 gender queer sister. Go ahead. Yeah. Um. Yeah. I'm his sister. Yeah. Right. Whatever. <laughs> um. Yeah. You don't believe me? Go 
Don't you want to know my name? No. My name is Guillermo. What's up, fool? I have... You thought I was a girl, fool? Stop watching the news. It's rotting your brain. I don't think so. Oh, yeah? What, which news station are you watching? You're watching to have Fox News? Is that what you're watching? No. What, you're listening to NPR? No, I'm watching Channel 17 News. <clears throat> it, it's got to be NBC, ABC, XYZ. It's got to be something. Yeah, whatever. Oh, my God. You just... Yeah. Excuse me, ma'am. Why do you just keep saying whatever? Because I can. <clears throat> okay, but don't you want to try to lighten? No, you need some helium. You're starting to get a deep voice on you, like you grew a few little chin hairs. You're starting to get a yeah. big dick. Whatever. I think our mom is come. I think I hear our mom. Whatever. <laughs> I hear I hear a key turning in the lock. I think we might we'll be in trouble if mom finds us on the phone. Yeah. We're running up the long distance rates again. Fucking uh -huh. peak time. Uh -huh. You don't act like you know what we're talking about, ma'am. You're rich. What? You're rich, ma'am. Don't don't act like you you can uh, you can uh, you know sympathize with us. Oh yeah, you on the phone with me. I need to call. I need to call your father. It's happened again. They left Luke. Oh no, they mother! This Luke woman's this woman's trying to sell us sex. What? I'm not a woman. What? I'm a man. God damn it! Man. Hello, hello. This, Who are you? What this woman here is using this old this woman's business. using her sex. She's using her sex against us, mom. Who are you? What are you doing with my son? Hello? 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 Hey, I'm trying to talk to you. Yeah? Who's this? Oh, this is Jack. I was calling because you had a uh, a pedicure schedule. You were, we were going to cut your toenails and uh, maybe put on a band of red lipstick. Make you feel good about yourself. Uh, you're not talking to me. I'm in bed. Well, Thank you for calling Fairfield and Sweet. How can I help you? I the animals they 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 followed me in. Like there's a seagull and he's perched on the door here. How do I is there like some way for me to remove them? I'm sorry. Cuz I what? didn't ask them to come in. The the seagull and the these creatures they just followed me in here. I I didn't invite them in. They just they came in. I opened um, the window and a I bird am? flew in. That's the thing. I I don't know. What's your last name? Forrest. The number four, O R S T. I'm a rapper. I usually rap around licorice, uh, sometimes the Jolly Ranchers. You're calling the Sussex Council of Silo. This is Lynn. Can you please hold for a moment? No, I can't. Okay. It wasn't a question. She was giving you a command. Well, I don't agree. I mean, she's a woman. I'm a man. So. Oh, I forgot him. Annie. Hi, I'm here to massage the Annie. Is the Annie available to be massaged? Oh, sorry. It's the wrong uh, number. Oh, no, no, you are the Annie. I'm coming to massage you. No, we no. can engage in misogyny together. No, no, uh, that's the wrong number, sir. Can I massage you? This is not the place Yeah, no. 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 This is the hotel no. where we engage in misogyny in the room. 
I want to massage your balls. Are you ready? We're coming. <laughs> Thank you for calling Best Western. I'm help you. Sarah Khanna. Sarah Khanna. Hello. Hello. Yes, sir. Front desk. I was I was told, I was told she would be here. May I see her, please? Who? Sarah Khanna. Um. Do you know in which room number she is? Two fifteen. Cyberdyne Systems, Model One O One. I know, so there is no one in two fifteen. Mm. I think she's in there. Uh, no, there is no one in two fifteen. Hmm. I just talked to her. What are you talking about? Yeah, there is no one in two fifteen. You keep saying that. You know, if you say something over and over again, it doesn't make it true. Can you just so, connect me to her? But nobody's in 215. Yeah. Well, we're going to play a new fun game. It's called Who is My Daddy? Thank you for calling Miss Brinkhill Sweets. This is Edward. How can I help you? Hey. Hey, I work with AT&T. There's a squirrel stuck in your phone line. I need you to check it, please. Hold on, what's that? Spring Hill Suites front desk. This is Renee. How can I help you tonight? Yeah, so there was a, there's an issue with your phone line. I guess a squirrel got stuck inside of it. I need you to just check it. Uh, unfortunately, we would have to have a contractor check it. You can't just go look at it and just see? Uh, we can't. I am the contractor. This is we AT&T. To, we don't have anything like that, unfortunately. You just, Sorry. We don't want to create Can you look? Deeper. I cannot. Well, we Sorry. own the line. We own the line. Just look at the line. You'll see the outline of a squirrel in, in, inside the line. Just tell me if you see it or not. Just look from your desk to the wall. I don't have a like a phone line like that. It's like indoors. What, what, where is the line at? Our line doesn't have a squirrel stuck in it. Have you seen any squirrels? We have not. Have you ever seen old cartoons? What? Have you ever used? Did you ever used to watch cartoons? Yes. Remember how they would get like stuck in through like little pipes and stuff? You would see their outline. Yeah, uh, yeah. I don't got anything like that's that. That's what that's what your phone is doing right now. No, your phone's doing that right now. There's a squirrel stuck in it. You need to go find it. You need to follow the line and find the squirrel. It's inside the phone line. Yeah, no, we wouldn't do that. Unfortunately, we have to have somebody look at it. Like we we. I, you can um yeah. You can unplug it from your end and blow on the receiver and probably blow the squirrel out. <laughs> uh, yeah, we'll, we'll, we'll be working on it. Thank you for letting us know. You need to get the squirrel out. I need, I, I need you to confirm you found it. Please. Go look. Yeah, I, I, I found the squirrel. It has, it has gotten out. Does it have your nut? Yeah. Uh, yeah, I have a kink in the phone line. The bro has your nuts? Yes. What's that? My, my, my non oh, Yeah, you like that, huh? I don't have any. Okay, good. Because uh, they're in your mouth. We, we don't, yeah, we don't carry them, unfortunately, here. All right, thank you. You have a great your night. Your non-existent nuts, can you swallow them? We, uh, we don't even know anybody on our this is Ashley. How can I help you? Hi, hi, Ashley. How are you? Good. How are you? Well, I'm decent. Uh, is there any? Do you have a lost and found by any chance? Yes, we do. Okay, my dentist has sent me. Well, not my dentist. My wife's dentist. Uh, we don't go to the same dentist. We disagree on some of his tactics. But last night, when we were staying in your hotel, 
uh, me and the wife got a uh, a little rough. And there was an accident. She hit her mouth on the corner of the dresser, like a little thing, table stand next to the bed, and her tooth came out. And we haven't been able to locate it yet. So we figured maybe someone from housekeeping may have found it. Wahoo Hurricane, this is Kim. Ah! What? <laughs> Mr. Miyagi would sit from his room and watch. Ten Sweet Phone Desk? As Daniel's son. Hello? Yes. Hi, uh, yeah, I need to stay there because there's a karate tournament in town. Do you have any rooms yeah. available? Oh, yeah. Yes, they have. Okay. Um, me and my trainer, Mr. Miyagi, need to oh. stay in the hotel. Oh. Are you what? Hey. Shh, be quiet. I'm trying to book the room. Okay. Oh. Just wait a second. I have guests. Let me check him in, and they will be with you. Okay. Oh. I wait on phone. Wait, wait. Oh. Oh. Yeah. Yeah. Show me. Show me paint the fence. Show me sun the floor. Show me wipe my butt back front. I mean front back, sorry. Hello? Hi. Are you? Yes. Yeah. I need a room with uh, two beds. Okay, for tonight? Yeah, do you have any like wooden posts outside that I could practice on? No. Oh, uh, because I need to practice the crane technique where I stand on one leg and uh, completely telegraph the fact that I'm gonna throw a kick and then throw a kick. Uh, it really yeah, no, works sorry, every time have... in my competition. Could I, would you be willing to fight me so that I could warm up for my uh, my match? Yeah, do you want a reservation or no? Yeah, I do. I'm just, I'm really excited so about this competition. Let me make you a reservation, but I, I cannot do anything than give you the service for the room. Yeah. I mean, I've got gear. I mean, you just have to hold the pad and I'll start throwing some kicks, you know, bam, 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 a combination. It's not that much, you know. And, uh, yeah, yeah. Hello? Hello? Shot for talking shit. No she uh Alaska. You know, fucking Fair. stuff somebody's yeah. Nikes up again. Hello? 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 Ah! Ah! Hello? Hello, ma'am? Hello, Hi. Hi. There's there's yeah. a squirrel there's Hello. a squirrel in my wall in my room. In my wall in my room. What? Yeah, I there's there's a hole in my room. And then there's a squirrel in my wall. Okay, um, what room are you in? I'm in two fifteen, and there's a hole. I didn't know if you guys were doing construction or what, but like okay. I can hear a scratching in there, and it's kicking all kinds of the installation out, and like into my room, and I stuff it back in, and it kicks it back out. Okay, um, get your things and come down here, and I'll switch your room. Um, just don't mess with it. Uh, yeah, I know, but like it keeps poking its head out, and like I'm like my luggage is right there, and every time I try to grab my luggage, it tries to bite me. I want to fuck the squirrel. Oh my god! Like oh it's my right god. there. My handle's right by the hole, so I try to grab the handle, and it, it fucking pops out, and it tries to bite me. It may, I don't know what its problem is. It's rabid, maybe I don't know. Okay. Uh, um, I don't even know what to do. Ah! You fucking bit me! Fucking cock! Are you fucking squirrel? Are you ah! serious? Ow! It bit my hand! Ah! Oh my god! Ah! Don't hurt Are it. You... Oh, then you get the fucking luggage, man. It fucking bit me! Oh, cocksucker bit Hi, me! Hi, I'm the squirrel. I'm the squirrel. Oh my god, the squirrel's talking. This is a miracle. 
It's a okay. Christmas miracle. It's a joke. That doesn't exist. No, ma'am. The squirrel is really talking. It's it's out of control. It's the first okay. talking so squirrel. Okay, so do you have a squirrel in your room or not? Yeah, and it's fluent in I'm, English. I'm, I'm, I'm just going to go over here. The squirrel fucked my wife. No, everybody fucked your wife. Um, <sighs> Ma'am, have you... Send them to you. Thank you for calling. Thank you for calling. Cobblestone Hotel and Suites in Seward, Nebraska. My name is Skyler. How can hey, I help you um, There's actually a squirrel in my wall. You're so hilarious. <clears throat> Shut up, the, la the last lady believed it. Yorkshire Motel, this is Nick. How may I help you? Hey, Nick, fuck you. Hey, that is a nice. Me Nick, nice I got your back. I got your he's back, got, Nick. He's got a big dick. Nick, the big front dick. Too, if you if you swing that way. I've seen it with my own eyes. <laughs> he's in New York. How can I help you? Yeah, uh, there's squirrels in my room and they're fighting right now. And they're what? I got they're two fighting. little fucking squirrels in my room and they're fighting. Like martial oh, no. arts status fighting. Well, that sounds terrible. Yeah, can you hear them? They're scrapping. Yeah, you should, you should bring them on down to the front desk. They're my pets. I, I can't get them. They're fighting. They're your pets. Well, I'll call 911 and send them to your room then. Wait a second. You said they're your pets? Yeah. Well, why don't you get your fucking fat ass down here and get them? I'll just call 911 and have them come on down and get you. You lazy. Come get your fucking squirrels out of my room. Yeah, I'll be right there. Yeah, you better get your fat ass up. <laughs> Thanks for calling your call. Do you like imagine? Hello? Hi, ma'am. We're, we're. You know the Bible you have in your room? Uh, yeah. Like it's 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 in a it's in a drawer. And me and my friends have been perusing through it. We've been looking through it a little bit. Um, and we decided, what is that thing when you when you talk to a, a confession? Is that what yeah. it is when you talk to a a, a priest? Yeah. Um, we were reading that part, and we just des we decided that, but well, we don't know whether there's a church, but we wanted to confess to the things that we've been doing in our room that are slightly illegal. And um, what are you doing that's illegal in your room? We're we're manufacturing uh, chemical psycho psychotropics uh, and addictive substances in our bathtub. And what room are you in? We're in two two fifteen, and we got the yellow suits on. Okay, and what is your name? My is my last name, or you want the first name? I'm not sure which one you want. I want both. Okay, the first the last name is Boy B O Y E E. Boy. Oh, the vapor alert's going off. Vapor. But we gotta hurry this up. I gotta stir. I gotta stir the bathtub. Vapor. No, I, I started. My my my, my first name is Pat. P A T. Vapor. And why are you calling to confess to Be the front desk? Because we were re we were reading the Bible because we were waiting for the cooking for the cooking to finish. Okay, are you wanting me to call the police on you or what? No, we need someone to come up and taste test. Yeah, we I, have uh, we're making pasta in the bathtub. Yeah, chicken noodle and, chicken noodle pasta soup. We want to know if it's al dente or not, but we don't have teeth so we can't tell. We're streaming on YouTube right now live and we're doing a show called Will It Flush? Vapor. Okay. Well, I thought I was gonna. I thought I was gonna swim in the pasta. You guys yeah, yeah, but when we gotta get rid of it, will it flush? Oh, we're gonna flush all the pasta down the toilet. Yeah, it makes sense. So we need someone to come taste test. We're gonna cook my friend in the in the hot the hot tub water 
with the noodles and the tomato soup, and then we're going to see if it'll flush. Vapor. I, I, so, I can consent to that. I'm sorry, sir, but I will not come to your room. Uh, if I do come, but we're live. Room, we're live with... streaming. You're you're live. You're live on the air right now. We're live streaming, and we're going to have all kinds of people come come to the hotel and book a room, and we're going to try will it flush in every room. Vapor. Yeah, you have to oh. come because we we promised our sponsor, Raid Shadow Legends, that we would be able to get someone from the hotel in here to kind of make yeah. it seem legit. Vapor. Yeah, we're, we're drug. I'm we're sorry, drug, I'm we're, sorry we're sir, but we can. We cannot do that. Um, and you tell me you're making Just something in the bathtub and stuff. I'm going to probably call the law and have them come check it out. No. No, no that's our friend it, right there. Not, He's going to flush pillows. He knows about pillows. Hey, it's not illegal to make jello in the bathtub. The fuck well, is it is when you're telling me you're making stuff in, a, in my bathtub and you're wanting me to come up by myself. Yes, I will have it's somebody. It's jello. That, We're making <laughs> jello. We're making jello in the bathtub. We don't have a big enough bowl. Come on. I'm sorry, sir, but I am not shit. coming to your room. <laughs> hey, everybody, everybody, look look at the stream right now. This lady on the phone right here, she's a bitch. She doesn't know how to have a good time and taste jello. Vapor. I'm on. sorry, Just sir. Just come taste it. I don't want them to taste I'm going to let you go. Lady, please. Lady, please mm -hmm. listen. <laughs> Great Hotel in York. This is Savannah speaking. How can I help you? Savannah. Uh, oh, my God. Savannah. No, Savannah. Savannah. The squirrel bit my friend. The Wait, squirrel what? Fucking, it me mad. The uh, squirrel that just came out of the goddamn wall. Uh, There's a hole in the wall. It came out and it bit my goddamn friend. I'm fucking what? Me Where were you in? We're in, we're in 215. This squirrel, I, it had hate in its eyes. Uh, okay, we'll be there in a squirrel. minute. I've got no no hang on. I've got the squirrel. Flush the squirrel. Flush the squirrel. Flush the squirrel. Flush the squirrel. No, don't flush me. Flush the squirrel. Don't flush me. Put his fucking head under the water, man. Flush that shit. I'm gonna waterboard this fucking um, squirrel. My coworker's on his way up right now. Okay, you tell him to bring a broom. My I'm coworker. Bend, bend the right, squirrel bet. over right now. I'm gonna fuck him. Is All right, that what bet. you We're call coming. little people now? Micro workers. <laughs> She left. She left. She left. And... So, Sorry, didn't make for us. Hello. Yes. Uh, I have a problem with my room. What's up? So you're not going to believe me, but there's a fucking there's a a crow. There's a crow in here. Like a bird. A fucking bird came in the room, man. I don't know how the fuck it got here, and it's just right there. And you know, my friend, the last boy, he is right there. I got to check the the message because there's a the crowd is making no noise, no noises. Is the window open? No, I think he's calling his friends. They're coming. Ah, oh, man, come on, man. Is the window open? There's no window, man. The fucking crows. Ah! Hey. One. Come down here. They're giving me. One of the crows' his name is Brandon Lee. They're getting me, man. The fucking crows are. They're getting me. Hello? That's Hello? funny, man. That's funny, man. You think it's a fucking joke, man? They're fucking getting me. I'm under the blankets. Which room are you in? <laughs> Talk to my brother. Talk to my There's brother. A There's a crow's nest in here. It's like we know when you go close to the nest, they get all crazy and they go, What the? Ah, ah. And they swoop down like that. Uh, and which room is that? Two fifteen. Oh my God, man! There's there's a oh. raven. There's a raven on the fireplace. He's looking at me. Oh, uh, he's a crow. 
<laughs> yeah, I think she's gone for this kind of him right now. But um, I'm gonna drag him off. You know, I'll get another personal assistant. Being such being a such baby. Baby. No. Can you hear me? They're fighting. What? There's people they're fighting, the crow and the squirrel. What room number? I remember that in the room two fifteen. My car What? I'm over here in the tube by the pillow. What room number you are in? God damn it, come over here. I tell you, the 215. Hey man, you feel that nobody's aggressive as fuck. Huh? Call the cops. You, uh, you Call talking to me? You talking to me? What? No. You talking to me? You talking to me? I don't know. Me? Who you talking to? Hmm? 250 Napoli room. Who are you talking Wrong to? Wrong number. Man? Wrong number. No, come over here. <laughs> the fuck was that? <clears throat> but six in Kearney, Nebraska. This is Greg. How yeah, hi. You? Uh, yeah, yeah, Greg, Greg, Greg. I don't have time to listen to your bullshit. Listen, I the birds are fucking loose in this room. Excuse me. I brought I brought three dozen crates of birds in here that I'm transporting for work because I can't leave them outside. I brought them in so that I could feed them and so they could be warm. And a couple of them got loose. They pecked through the fucking crates, bro. All right. What room number is this? I'm in 215, and I think it's the crows that got loose. Okay. And hey, what's your name? My, na my name's Dwight, and I'm an, I'm an avian criminal. Okay, and what is this regarding? Is it's regarding the, bir the birds loose, to, loose in my room. Okay. And what's your name again? Dwight, the avian criminal. Dwight? Okay, and what yeah, is this regarding? Yeah, the Indian criminal. The yeah, what is this criminal? They think okay. about the bird. A little worm. Okay, and what's your name again, please? My name is Dwight the Avian Criminal. Dwight the ah. Avian Criminal. Uh, is that Latin? No, it's English. Dwight it's English. is my first name. Like, where's that from? Don't be, don't be, don't be a fucking pecker. All right. Now listen, we're gonna have a problem. Okay, and what room number is this? It's two fifteen. Two fifteen. Okay, and what's your name again, please? Yeah. Dwight, the avian <laughs> criminal. <laughs> okay, and what's this about? It's about the birds. The birds. The the Hitchcock yeah. movie. No, it's about the fucking birds that I have in my room that pecked their way out of the crates. Okay, uh, and what's your name again, please? Dwight the Avian Criminal. Okay, and uh, if you don't about? know what avian means, it means bird, motherfucker. It's about the bird flu. Hi, right, man. The bird is getting my pee pee. This is a little worm. Ah! Yeah, what do you not understand about that, asshole? But what room number is this again? It's 215. <laughs> Help my pee pee, please. Help me. <laughs> yeah, so you're upsetting him. You know, there was okay. another Birds movie. Was there? There was a bird. Yeah, it's about in Silicon Valley. It was really cheesy. It was about this guy who uh, was in San Jose and he was, he had, he had Is said he had Polly? realized his. He had realized his Silicon Valley dream because there's a scene where he just closes a deal for several million dollars and puts his arms behind his head and he's like, that's it, I'm done. I'm 23 years old and I never have to work again. Yeah. And then his girl's like, oh, I want to do you and marry you because you're rich. And then the birds showed up and everything went to shit. The end. 
That sounds pretty <laughs> terrible. It's a great movie. It's real. It's a real movie. I'll okay, get a movie, Polly. I, I, I where, believe it. Uh, uh, do, do you recall you the know that guy, name? Monk, who played... Yeah, hold on. Let me look at it. There was a movie about this guy who was a janitor, and he befriends and all his entire bird lifetimes about the bird. And then the whole oh, so movie you're, you're is just like up. what happened to the bird. It's called Polly. Oh, he's in orbit right now. He's on God internet. damn it! Yeah, it's because the birds are pecking the lines. Yeah. Oh, sure. There's a bird yeah. in the line. I got birds on the wires. Yeah, the birds, the birds they got they bird weigh, on the wires. They weigh down the, damn it. the lines, oh, and then the lines, they right? stretch. And then the, when the lines stretch, they get longer, and it takes longer for the message to get to you. Well, sure, but don't you know the birds aren't real? The government that's, surveillance. Oh, that's latency. Oh, this is bad. Oh, this my real God. Bad. Okay, I'm my mind is just... just gonna shut up. <laughs> we got to go. We got to go. <laughs> All right, you guys have a good one. All right, just look chat. To a fucking new guest. The King Turner Tweets Carney, how may I help you? Hi. Um, I have a problem right now. Hi. Hello, I have a problem. Yes. Uh, so you see, I took a pillow from my friend next door. The guy, I took his pillow, and I, I he was laying down on the bed, but he was. Every night, according to I lifted the by Marriott. Can I do for you? I got the movie oh. wrong. I got the movie wrong. It's called Bird Demon. It's this movie where. Yeah. Thank you for calling Hampton. Marty, this is Al. How can I help you? Yes, there is a problem. I went next door to borrow the pillow from the friend. And uh-huh. I lifted the bed because it was moving. It was moving, the blanket. And I, I said, I need a pillow, man. And I lifted the, the, the blanket and there was birds under the blankets. Oh, that's cool. No, it's not cool. It's a bunch of birds in the fucking room. <laughs> well, that's cool. What room are you in? Talk to my brother. You're fucking piecing me off, man. Talk to my brother. The that's birds, are, they're, they're really causing yeah. a problem for me. Okay. okay. Yeah, ma'am, he's hes in here hes in here trying to fry up uh, crows again. And we keep trying to crows? explain to him that's bad for the soul. Yeah, that's bad for the soul. And yeah, so he's in here. He's really he's he's, he's, uh, he's gonna do. He say, "Oh, the pigeons! I'm going to deep fry the pigeons." Sure that's how you get out. So there's, a, there's, there's a big difference. There's a big sure difference between pigeons excited. and crows. <laughs> that's what I'm trying to tell him. But there's there's a lot there's a lot of communication since he's Spanish. Oh, I don't yeah, really yeah, speak I, a lot yeah, of English. Yeah, yeah, I, yeah, yeah. Me comprendo. Uh, yeah, he's 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 he's, he's, so, he's uh he's, so besides the birds, yeah, he's Spanish, so he speaks Japanese. That's well, impressive. Can I mean that it bilingual. Yeah, bilingual. Yeah, yeah. yeah he's a uh, he speaks Japanese Esperanto. You should oh, see what else he can do wow. with his tongue. That's pretty impressive. Wow, well, I it, not Ichiban. Yeah. My imagination. Ichiban Teniso. <laughs> yeah. Why am I? It's just dead, honey. Ichiban. It just did. Okay, so besides the birds, anything else? You, you treat them. Now you're what, thinking about what he could do. The with crows. The yeah. crows. They need gravel. They need gravel in order to live. So just feed them the, gravel. And they'll the, be counting, fine. The, the counting crows. Well, that's not are at you, all true. You, that's you a, know what that's happened. an old I, wife's tale. I, what happened was I was laying down and I put my pee pee outside of the blanket and the birds that's, thought it was a worm and they call me and they go down and they try and peck in my pee pee. So well, that seems yeah, to be I'm an issue. Be taking... you're, you're calling the you're you're calling the wrong person for that though. My brother needs an ambulance. <laughs> I'm gonna be taking the or. Oh. Yeah, ma'am. Yeah, we call I'm... we we call we call the bird uh, catastrophe because it's a dumb bitch. You, oh, well, that's bird ain't my bird. That yeah, that happens. So don't don't. So I'm okay. on my way there right now. I'm on my uh-huh. way. Um, yeah. But I'm taking the Oregon Trail, and I might yeah. like, not make it and die of dysentery. Uh, so. With the wind, with the wind, I don't blame you. Yeah, it's, it's got to be terrible. Yeah, he broke a wagon wheel. Is it going to be a snake? He yeah, broke a wagon wheel as well. Well, that, and that happens. That that happens. Watch out for the Indians. 
That's all I can say. Build a large. Oh fire. no, That's we don't call racist. them. We don't call oh, them that racist anymore. bitch! Oh my you god! Dumb racist bitch. I'm not being racist at all. I'm just saying, watch out. They, Native Americans. They they, 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 they scout Native people. Native Americans, that Indian. Holy oh no! They scout people. Racist. Yeah, you betcha. I'm, I'm, I'm the, I'm the, you know, I'm the are, biggest racist person you'll ever see. It matter what their see. habits are. They are people, too, ma'am. Oh, they, absolutely. Absolutely. They deserve respect. Ma'am. They deserve absolutely. respect. Yes. Thank you. Absolutely. Ma'am. So, uh, if somewhere... And, and so, if so somewhere um, I, I'm, need, I'm need, I am what you call Native American. I say Indian. You say Native American. I don't care. You say potato, oh, I say, I say savage. Potato. Let's call the whole thing off. <laughs> okay, so what else can I do for you guys? Exactly. Well, is there, somewhere, is there somewhere I can hang my moccasins to dry when I get there? Oh, over the fireplace, yeah. My snow uh-huh. shoes are wet. Yeah, yeah we got, like some, we got wet my some of that old. Dry right now. You got one of them boot Absolutely. dryers? Uh, we have a fireplace. Yeah. That'll work. Oh, that's good. For the good. Weather. Yeah, thank you. Yeah. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Yeah. Anything else I can help you with, gentlemen? Uh-huh. Yeah, can you uh, put on something pretty and hang out with me by the fireplace? Is that doable? Oh, I'll go I'll find my phone. I'm to be in the background. Yeah, I'll go find my phone. I, mean, I want to sit on the couch, and I want to watch you guys uh, snuggle up by the fireplace. How about that? Oh, I'll right. let you oh, come, wow. come that pet my like little chicken. That sounds like a or something. I have a dog named Chicken. Oh really? Why, why did you do was that? Was confused? Why did you do that? Well, I don't know why. Very confused. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I bet like, so. I, my friend it's has like a dog called... named Cricket, which I don't understand. <laughs> it's like, what if I called you Monkey? What if I called you Monkey? You know? Oh, I'd probably then, be you know, belligerent. Be like, ah, 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 ah. That's what it would be like. Well, that's really oh, good. come you on. Do you can do again? better than that. Do better than that, please. Please. Like, I, like put was, your, put your fist time. under your under. <laughs> there, see? I, there you go. There you go. I want to okay, no, 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 get going. Do an actual howl, please. No, well, no, that, ma'am. That, no, that no, was no, so no, awesome. No. Thank you for calling me and entertaining me for a little while, but I really got to get it back to work. So, show us your pussy. Yeah, I love no. you. Nah, good night. <laughs> It doesn't do words really well. Hello? There's a bird. Hello? Hi. Hello. Knock, knock. Who's there? Safonda. Is that a bird? No, Safonda. I didn't say bird. It's oh. Safonda. Yeah, there's birds. There's birds. Anything I can help wow, you? Wow, everybody's really, you're really bad at knock-knock jokes, aren't you? Yeah. Did you're you write the short say bus? who's there, sir. <laughs> aren't you all a bit old for knock-knock jokes? Hey, fuck no, you. I'm, I'm an avian sexual. Yeah. We, we fuck birds, man. Oh, right. No, I gotta go. Back. No. <laughs> Hi, I found a merkin in my room. Your room? What is happening? Yeah, there's a merkin. There's a, there's a merkin duvet in here. Merkin, I didn't follow what it is all about. It's a vagina wig in my room. Uh-huh, okay. It, it looks like it came from your mother, Mother Chod. Uh-huh. Sandra, fall over it. Do you, do you know Mother Chod? No, no, I don't know, brother. Oh, do you do Chutia Masala? Chat Masala? No, Chutia Masala. No, I don't know. Okay, Terry. Okay, Maki, anyhow, sure. anyhow, anyhow, I will let you know in the yeah. morning. Okay, I will try to. Oh. What is your room no. number? So, actually, I stay on GB Road with your sister and your mother, but I want to stay there. Okay, I will let you know in the morning. What is the room number? No, I'm your. I'm your. Fifteen. I'm your. Huh? 
I'm your Bob. You know? Your father. Mm. I have sex, your mother. I my father. We make fuck with your sister's mouth. Thank you for calling Lexington Holiday and Express. How can I help you? Hi. I need uh, two moon over my hammy, uh, eggs over easy, sausage patties. Um, uh, do you have pumpernickel bread? Sure. Let me just transfer you to the correct department. Hold on. Oh, this isn't the head waitress department? <laughs> oh, bitch. Oh, where are we going? <laughs> I hope it's security. So go to the motel. What? Hi. Oh. Hello. Hey, does it, does it sound like does it sound like the guy that knocked on the door and called you a bitch? Nope, but does it? Hey, no, I'm not talking to you, motherfucker. I'm talking yeah, to my he, son. Yeah, he called me name, and he took <laughs> my he he took my yeah, game away from me. Yeah, he. You really mean. Did he you take his Game him. Boy? Did you take he, his Game Boy away? He did. And he, <laughs> and he took <laughs> Zelda. <laughs> where are you, 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 you trying to call? Broken. Christy, I'm calling like, the front desk. Yeah. Christy stepped on my foot, took the game, and then took the I'll batteries do. out and threw them on the floor and said, Ha ha! You, you, you think you're, you're, Sir, you think you're did, calling did, the front desk? Yeah, I, how, I, do you, I, how do you I, plead I, to your crimes? <laughs> I, uh, have a good night. That's a nervous laughter, sir. Bring him up on bring him up bring on charge. Write him up. Bring him up on charge. Who is the other Bob? Bob. What did he do? Hello. Hello, Bob. 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 Yeah, uh, I'm sorry, uh, sir. My 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 wife was late for the last Kegel class, and I was wondering if uh, there's like another one going on. Uh, is is Stacy still working the Kegel class? Sorry, who? Stacy. Uh, I Ow. think you might have the wrong number. Oh, sorry. <coughs> oh, I'm choking out water. No, I don't. I'm I'm, I'm calling the hotel, right? Uh, yeah. Okay. Yeah. I, I'm out of town right now, but my wife is still there. She's at the gym, and she was wondering if if, if you guys still had the Kegel class going on. Like later on in the day, because she missed the first one. Uh, um, not that I'm aware of. No. Um, you, I mean, you, you know what I'm, you know what I'm talking about, right? The Kegel class. Uh, it's where they like, it's like a thigh exercise or something. I don't know. Uh, let me see if there's... it's kind of like one of those. Uh, yeah, look up Kegel class. There's got to be a Kegel class going on. At, at least like. More than once a day, I would imagine, right? Uh, let me check real quick. There can't just be one. It's like Highlander. There can't, there can't, there can't be more than one. But there has to be more than one. But it's like the opposite of Highlander. You know what I mean? Yeah, yeah. Uh, here, let me real quick just hit up, uh, ask my boss. Sorry, I'm new here. Um, uh, but okay. I'll ask right, my boss. Actually, uh, the, Right. Well, actually, uh, while I have you on the phone, my neighbor, he's got, like, these weird birds. Uh, I don't know, in room 216, there's, like, a there's a bunch of weird bird sounds coming from that room. I, I don't know what that, I don't know what that is. It's like he's got, a, like, a like a murder of crows in there or something. You hear that? Oh, yeah. Yeah. It's like they, they heard me talking about it, and they, they just started getting loud. God, dude, these things are. I mean, I mean, I like birds, but I don't. I don't know, like the uh, the legality of having birds in a hotel room. You know? Yeah, well, we've had parakeets before. You might want to check on that. Yeah. Yeah, but no, he's got like a he's got like a flock. He's got like a whole a whole like a mess of birds. It's like a murder of birds. There's probably a murder in the hotel room next to me. There's a flock of seagulls too. Yeah, it's a great band, actually. Alrighty, I'll have a look. Okay. Alright. And there's a gaggle of peace. Uh, 
Okay. Oh, no. All right. There's a thing with an ego. I accidentally dropped breadcrumbs. The slippery slug slithered slowly southward, <laughs> seeking sustenance, sir. I wished. If I had chickens, I would totally make Tires are bird bags. You have reached the roadway in and Cozad, Nebraska. Oh, thank God. I thought somebody answered. I was hoping <laughs> someone answered so you could explain your bird Please enter the extension number or press the pound oh. sign. You will be transferred uh, to extension O. Please hold. Why isn't... I broke it. You know how parking lots have uh, speed bumps. Why not just have speed chickens? Hmm. Hello? Jason, who took our bird vest? How? Who took my bird vest? What? Yeah, vest of birds up here. Yeah, vest of birds up here. Somebody took them. Yeah, I could have sworn you had a bird vest. How? How? I can't find the bird vest. This guy's a real motherfucker, okay? The birds, they get irritated when they're not vested. If we don't vest them soon, they're gonna roost. And when they roost, that's not good. It's, a good, it's not a good thing. They don't like to be chilly. Thank you for choosing my friend. Yeah. Oh. Hello? Thank you for choosing the quantum by window. Hi, I'm here, but the birds, they are here too, and they are pecking at me. Is there any recourse here? How can I get rid of the birds? Hello? Yeah, the, the birds, they like peck peck. Hello? Uh, what birds? Well, there's crows and there's, I think there's seagulls. I don't know where they come from, but they, they came out of it when I got out of my car. I, I might, I might be to blame a little bit. I dropped my Subway sandwich and I tried to pick it up all the crumbs, but the birds found it. Now there's over a hundred birds. Oh, they're going away. Oh, Hello? Hello? It had four wings and they were all like helicopters. Oh, thank you for calling the comfort in. It's Michelle. How can I help you? Hi, ma'am. Hi, ma'am. Uh, Hi. I, I was just wondering. Um, What's your what's your your like your bird policy? Because I'm out here and uh, I I had my wallet sit on my lap and this bird came and took it. So like you guys got like people that like could keep track of birds or do I have to like uh, do no. the investigation myself or what? Um, that would be on you actually. Sorry. No, no, well, but no, no. Your insurance should cover it because I was on your property and the bird came and took my wallet. So it. It's really on you. It just uh, it, it, it's uh, it's up to you whether or not I have to get the police involved. This bird just up and stole my wallet, ma'am. Okay. Well, um, yeah, that oh. sounds like something you're gonna have to deal yeah. with. But um, yeah, we'll have a good night. No, no. Hey, Dr. I'm gonna help you. Yeah. Um, is there any? Um, women working the front desk tonight, or is it just you? It's just me. Okay. Um, I kind of have a situation. Um, I'm sorry, I'm going to go into a little bit of backstory, but um, my my wife and I recently lost our, our daughter to cancer, and um, we had come to the hotel to kind of rekindle our relationship. And uh, my wife had just found out that she was pregnant about a month ago, and um, she's going through a miscarriage right now. And, and it's not it's not uh, any sort of medical emergency or anything like that, but I, 
Just wondering if um, maybe there's some flowers or something down there I could get her. Oh, we don't sell flowers. Okay, because she, she was about six months along, and um, we're having... Sorry, this is really hard. Um, we're having some trouble getting the, the baby down the toilet. <laughs> kind of... Um, it's kind of... Uh, Almost fully formed. And I'm not sure what to do. Can you send someone up here? Yeah, Hello? we don't have any flowers now. Dude, man, you have no heart. All right, play the bird. Yeah, I don't. You stupid. The bird. I'll fuck you. What the fuck? I, just, I wanted to end it on a letter <laughs> note. Running something off his phone screen. Hello? 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 Yes. Yes. My wife Miriam, there's a crow that was pecking on her tits. Hello? Hello? Yes. The birds. Good evening, thank you for calling Motel 6, the big friends of grass this day. Hey, I, I, I left the window open and a bird came in my room. <gasps> what? I left the window open and a bird, it's getting Miriam. <laughs> what, room number, what room number are you in? They're pecking on her nipples because they're pointy. <laughs> What group number are you in? Uh, the bastards! The birds! Hello? Hello? What room number are you in? Damn it, the fucking birds are in the room! Hello? Hey. Oh, my God. Is this all y'all got to do? Yeah. You know what? This ring is is really bad weather over here. Somebody just called me from your number? Yeah. With the recording. Hello? Yeah. Oh, my God. Is this all y'all got to do? Yeah. You know what? Hello. Yeah, what? Where did you find my number? Excuse me? Uh, I think something's getting mixed up in between the lines. Who are you? Uh, I'm someone from Georgia that got a random call that was threatening from this number. What? Ha ha. Oh, really? Because I can tell you right now, my husband. Go ahead. You have sat there and harassed me and harassed me on my show. What? Motherfucker, what the fuck, you punk ass bitch? You tripping on acid, man. Yeah. Uh-huh. Yeah. You fucking loser. You tripping on acid, man. Good luck with your Christmas, but I doubt you're gonna have any. Hello. Hello. Yeah, that is. That's me. I'm trying to call about, uh, you know, I suppose to meet the man down in uh, J&J. I'm so proud of you. Go, boy. You go, boy. What I'm trying to ask you that I'm under bad weather up here, and I'm in the uh, Clarksville, uh-huh. and, uh, and I'm going to see if he want to ch- change that uh, to Sunday or Monday or whatever, but uh, I didn't want to put that. I do uh, have it up to 11. I didn't want to put that um, uh, bush whacker on the truck there and get it all wet. I've been in the barn there. I, I didn't. 
I uh, don't want to mess it up, but uh, I just because of the weather, the ninety percent rain up in. Uh, How did you get I, my I brother's address and my name, as well as if Jennifer's he, name? And why are you calling people in the middle of the night looking up their information? I tried to call last night about nine to find out. I think y'all was at a ball game. Oh my gosh, that is so wild. Why would you do that though? But uh, I was going to call him and see if he wanted to, me to bring it down there and, and uh, get it in the bad weather there. Or uh, that don't know what's so going to happen the rest of the day. It's going to rain today and tomorrow. And it's raining now on me. Up here. I'm in the uh, in Mount area. That's crazy. You know, he, 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 he called me about the bushwhacker, and I, and I figured I'd call him to see if, uh, if he wants me to bring it on down there in the bad weather. I'll do it. You should starve yourself and just eat air. And, uh, yeah, and you shouldn't eat ever. And uh, he he wants me to change the date on it. We'll change the date or I'll bring it on. And then see if you'll die. And, uh, I like shit. It's, it's this real nice piece of equipment there. The, DNR is getting twenty three hundred. I told my let him have for eight. I do eat shit. But uh, last night I tried to call. I picked y'all was at a ball game or something because whoever asked the phone asked me to, was this about the ball game. I I like to eat that and boogers. So I'm gonna wait and see if he he, he wants to call me back and tell me uh, when we can uh, do it again tomorrow or Monday or Tuesday or whatever he wants me to do. No, I don't, I don't like that because it's got a bitter taste. I tried it, I, but it, it has gonna, a bitter taste. I was gonna let him. Uh, it didn't digest uh, well, and so I just continued on and kept on just doing the um, burgers and the the shit, and it worked out perfectly. I'll let him call me and tell me when the best time to try to meet him at his convenience. I can come down any time, but I don't want to get this thing wet. Oh. So I'll get away and let him call me, okay? Yeah. Okay. Thank you, Dan. Uh-huh.